One technology expert here at QVC, oh, Mr. Right. Brett Hamilton. He, Brett. Wasn't, he wasn't available tonight. The number one, so standing in. <laughs> Is the number two. It's the number three <laughs> and a half. No, Brett, we love you. We learn so much from you, and it's and it's always so fun to oh, work thanks. with you. And I'm happy that you're in the studio. Cool. And now we're going to get started with <clears throat> the Echo, the smart speaker yep. with Alexa, and we're saving over forty-five dollars. <clears throat> okay, this one is the lowest price we I'm found. Not quite sure Did how you know? You don't even know about the prices usually. I don't pay so, attention to the money. Yeah. I know you never pay attention to the money, but I have to tell you, if you Google Schmoogle right now. You are going to see that this is the lowest price, even on their own website. Okay, I'm just saying. I'm just telling you. Well, that's so. the nice part about it. Usually, when we have it, it's more money there, which is nice, right? Yes. The, and you can go check. You can. I mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't believe me, so I would go check as well. Agreed. But, uh, I, let me tell you a quick story. I just looked this up a couple days ago. The Echo came out. The original Echo came out ten years ago. Next week. So we are just shy of the 10 year anniversary. And that's something I found on my own. It's not like Amazon is, is hailing that or whatever. The reason I bring that up is because when the first speaker came out, it was this tower. Yeah. And you could ask it for the time and maybe you could get it to play a song and you could set an alarm. And at the time for like 150 bucks, you were like, hey man, if it never gets any better than this, that's pretty cool. Those times have changed drastically. And I'm gonna show you in one quick demonstration how cool this item is. I play the old, if it just did this game, it's worth the price of admission, which is $55. Take a peek over my shoulder at this Christmas tree right here. When the Echo was first released, it couldn't turn on your appliances. It couldn't change the look of your room. It certainly couldn't prevent you from climbing under the tree and plugging it in, <laughs> but now it can. Alexa, turn off the Christmas tree. Okay. Thank you. If it just did that it's to your coffee maker, <laughs> to the lights in your bedroom, more importantly, forget the lights in your bedroom, because if this is in your bedroom, it turns, off, it turns off the lights in the family room, in the basement, in the kitchen. Alexa, turn on the Christmas tree. Okay. There you go. There you go. So Look if we that. stopped right here, we still have six minutes left. If we stopped right here. $55. $55. And it plays music, <laughs> and it doesn't do anything else. It's, it, I'm, not, I'm not trying to be funny. I just feel like that is incredible. And, and I always say this every time I do that demonstration, Rosina. Yeah. When I say turn thing on or turn off, I'm like, this is never going to work. And it's not because I don't believe in the Amazon technology or the smart plug technology. It's just like, how in the hell does it? Does this thing turn that off? I don't know. Do you, I'm not, I'm not that you, smart. But anyway, it comes in three colors. Listen, it does. So I can't, yeah, that is right there. Amazing. Now this is the charcoal. In the middle, we have that beautiful uh, twilight blue. 300 remain in the twilight blue. These are going quickly and a lot of us are buying multiples. And, and they this do come with a power cord. I just didn't show it because it's ugly. I have, here's, the, the, here's the power cord white. if you really need to see what a cord looks like, but there you go. Wait, what, 400 in the glacier white. It has a power cord. There's a power cord, so it yeah. comes with that. Does it have to be plugged in? It does. It has to be plugged in and you have to connect it to the Alexa app, which is connected to the internet. So let's, let's go backwards real quick before we do another magic trick. Out of the box, if you put the Her app on your phone, and you turn the app on, it automatically says, I found an Echo. So all you do is say yes, and it connects it to the internet. As long as your phone is already connected to the internet, you don't have to do anything. You don't have to sign in, you don't have to do any of that nonsense. And all of a sudden you have this device that gets smarter and smarter, and I'm not just making that up. Every single day, it learns something new. So you're fluent in Spanish, clearly. Yes. Um, what do you, okay, let me ask you, uh, I'll give you a simple one. How do you say, where's the bathroom in Spanish? I'm going to ask you. ¿Dónde está el baño? Alexa, how do you say where is the bathroom in Spanish? Where is the bathroom in Spanish is? ¿Dónde está el baño? <laughs> well, we have an expert standing next to me, so we know she's not lying. Isn't that cool? <laughs> that is right, I that's mean, so cool. Any language, any phrase, like you, you could actually teach yourself to speak another language just by asking her questions. In Italiano. Oh. Do, dove, dove il baño? Alexa? How do you say where's the bathroom in Italian? Where's the bathroom in Italian is? Dove il bagno? Wow. Dove il bagno? I didn't realize you speak Italian too. Si. Wow. Anche. Sono Argentina e Italiana. Oh, all right. So. Argentinian, Italian from New York. 
<laughs> and then and then South and then Miami. And I'm sure she doesn't have the Miami vibe going on there like you do. One point for Rosina, take away one from Alexa. But uh, you, you get the idea. Yeah, but she's got a lot more points than I do in a lot of other things. So. Well, I, I listen, even if you're not a sports fan, I'm going to show you something right now that's really going to kind of put into perspective how smart this device is. World Series Game 1 started about an hour ago, almost to the minute. If you were walking around doing your thing, you know, have access to the TV or whatever, and you just want to know the score, 10 years ago when this device came out, she would say, I don't know the answer to that. You would have to wait for the game to end. The next day you could ask her, Alexa, what's the score of the Yankee game? The New York Yankees are tied with the Los Angeles Dodgers 0-0 zero zero in the mm. top of the fourth inning. Watch this. With two outs and none on, Jack Flaherty is pitching to Anthony Rizzo. The count is 2-2. Two and two. So, so... Not just the score, which is probably good enough. I got the inning. I know who's pitching. I know the count. I know who's uh, just, it's just incredible to me that you get that real time information. Wow. So apply that to a news update, apply that to the weather, apply. Oh, okay. So you wake up first thing in the morning and you still haven't, haven't even focused on what day it is. Can I get another 10 minutes rest? Alexa, how's the traffic? Brett, right now, traffic on your commute looks good. The fastest route takes about 16 minutes via Creek Knoll Lane and US 322. Now, how does she know that? Because you can go into the app, you can put your destination, and she gives you real-time traffic updates. Uh, on top of all that, in the kitchen, my wife and I use this for, for two or three things every single day without exaggeration. We use the timers all the time. We use the shopping list, which I'm about to show you. And I can't be in a quiet room, so I constantly bring up music. I have Sirius XM linked to mine, so I could say play Sirius XM 80s on 8 or First Wave or whatever it might be. But I love the shopping list thing. You're about to make uh, your shopping list. The, the days of the little paper list and stuff are over. Um, uh, give me something you want to add to your list so they know it's not a, a magic trick. Cranberry juice. Alexa, add cranberry juice to the shopping list. Cranberry juice added. What it does is you put the app for her on your phone and then you go into the shopping list and she will record that so that if you're walking down the aisle, uh, it's going to be tough. Yeah, uh, yeah, all right, yeah, friend, yeah. friend, stay with me. I'm just going to, let me just bring my brightness down. It's live TV. He got uh, it. He I, got it. I just want to show you guys how Camille cool, got it. how cool this is because when you think about the fact that we used to have to carry around, all right, there it is. Cranberry juice. Where? Right there. Right there. We just added it seconds I ago. Look. I don't know what a pork sandwich bag is. I think that was supposed. I think she may have misunderstood <laughs> me. I don't even eat meat, so I'm pretty. I'm fairly certain I don't need sandwich bags for pork. <laughs> <laughs> I already got the body wash and all the other stuff. So the idea is that this thing is there, and she does it for you just by asking. Can I? Make calls. phone calls? Yeah, you can make calls. Uh, you, can, you can connect and, and, and do all that stuff anytime you want. And the, the person on the other side doesn't have it, you can call their phone. You, can just, you just have to go through the Amazon universe to make that happen. But in the end, I think that most of us, and, and I'm sure you're included here, and, I'm, and it's not a knock, we don't want to have to worry about how the technology works. No. Right? Am I, am I, am I clear yes, there? Yes, of course. We and I don't care how it works. I don't care honest. how it works. I just want to be able to go, okay, I take this thing out of the package, I plug it into the wall, and all of a sudden I can ask her essentially anything. And look, and talk about simplicity. Look at this. You've got a, 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 a button for reset. You've got volume up, you've got volume down, and you've got a microphone mute. So anybody at home going, she's listening, she's listening, she's listening. Let me tell you a little story. She doesn't hear what you say until you say her name. When you say the wake word, the brain, the brain comes to life. Really? Right. It's kind of like a wheel, and the wheel's just, it's just sitting there. It's waiting to hear, and then it goes, and everything you say after that, based on that request, gets registered. That's why sometimes if you mispronounce her name or you don't say it correctly or whatever, and she doesn't respond, it's because she's not hearing you until you wake her up. When you wake her up, it's all it's fair game. Okay. Everything that we just did right now in the last eight minutes is just like scratching the surface, oh, yeah. right? So at the lowest price anywhere, lowest price that we found, we did the shopping around for you, but... Like Brett said, you don't have to believe me. You could do it right yeah, now. Go, go, go on website. Google and put in. Go to Amazon. Am, go to Amazon. Amazon Echo Smart Speaker with Alexa 4th Gen. Yeah. Do that 
and see if this is not the lowest price. Plus, free shipping and handling. And we have these gorgeous colors. This is one of those gifts. You don't even have to be techie. Nope. You, you, the, the app is not difficult to, to, to download and set up. So what a great gift for everyone, all ages. Even the younger, the young ones love this, like 12 year olds even, love to, to, to play music and things like that. So if you want the Twilight Blue, only 270 remain. It's already the most popular and people are buying multiples. This will go quickly. Everyone is loving the fact that this is the lowest price uh, that we have found and that you will find right now on air. Uh, this is the charcoal and this is the glacier white. And for perspective, well. like maybe just a little bit larger than a softball for, for just perspective. Literally. For, like, yeah. That's exactly. It. That's it. Okay, by the way, if you